Ever since the first studies of the Great Pyramid in Egypt have been made, researchers have been amazed at the mathematical knowledge that is encoded into the Great Pyramid. Even the placement of the Great Pyramid has aroused great interest among Egyptologists. The Great Pyramids of Giza have fascinated humankind for over 4,500 years. These monumental structures built by the ancient Egyptians stand as awe-inspiring reminders of a civilization that mastered engineering and astronomy. While the mainstream explanation has long been that the pyramids served as tombs for the pharaohs, a new theory has begun to gain traction. Could the pyramids have been part of an ancient power source capable of harnessing energy in ways we still don't understand? With the help of cutting-edge AI and advanced radar tomography, modern researchers are uncovering a whole new layer of mystery surrounding these enigmatic structures. Some scientists now believe that the pyramids may have been far more than just impressive burial sites. In fact, they may have served as complex energy systems, tapping into Earth's natural forces and potentially using technology far ahead of its time. Today, we'll explore how AI has brought us closer to understanding the true purpose of the Great Pyramids, shedding light on an ancient energy source that could rewrite history. The conventional understanding of the pyramids. Egyptologists and archaeologists have long concurred on a relatively simple explanation for the pyramids. They were huge tombs built to contain the pharaohs and preserve their bodies and possessions for the afterlife. This is in keeping with conventional archaeology, which dates the building of the pyramids to Egypt's Old Kingdom, the Fourth Dynasty, around 2600 to 2500 BCE. Amongst these great monuments, the Great Pyramid of Giza, commissioned by Pharaoh Khufu, is still the most iconic and intimidating. Building these jaw-dropping pyramids was nothing short of astonishing. It meant huge quantities of resources, advanced engineering, and a huge amount of manpower. Tens of thousands of construction workers, stonemasons, and fine craftsmen toiled in the complicated process of quarrying, moving, and placing the tremendous stone blocks together. Archaeologists have discovered some remnants of working villages close to the pyramids, which point towards a carefully organized and functioning workforce that accomplished this ambitious mission. The capacity to attempt such colossal labor was facilitated through Egypt's vigorous economy, copious agricultural assets, and fully developed administrative procedures. The government could mobilize extensive quantities of labor, plan resources, and preserve social solidity, all serving to contribute fundamentally to the pyramid construction. Whilst these buildings, as tombs, were nevertheless awe-inspiring, there always existed a sort of residual speculation regarding their intrinsic meaning. With time, most scholars came to consider the possibility that the pyramids could have had a function other than a strictly funerary one. They might have also served as spiritual portals, a manifestation of the Egyptians' belief in the afterlife, or as symbolic models of the ascension to the heavens. But with the introduction of AI and contemporary technology, we may now be about to discover a whole new theory. These ancient structures could have had a significantly more utilitarian and perhaps even futuristic use than we once believed. With technological advancements growing by leaps and bounds, it's increasingly evident that the pyramids could have been designed for a use other than burial and religious purposes. They may have acted as tools for energy harvesting or done intricate tasks that are beyond our present imagination of ancient people. New discoveries beneath the pyramids. Recent advances in non-invasive imaging technology have enabled archaeologists to look deeper into the pyramids' secrets, unearthing hidden information beneath the surface of these ancient monuments. Though the above-ground pyramids themselves have long been the subject of research, new science has turned its focus below, unearthing new chambers, 
passageways and gigantic underground structures that have lain hidden for thousands of years. One of the greatest advances is from radar Doppler tomography, a new scanning system that revolutionized the way scientists study big solid objects such as the pyramids. While ground-penetrating radar traditionally has difficulty penetrating hard rock, Doppler-based systems sense micro-seismic tremors, tiny movements in the surroundings. These tremors allow scientists to map out high-resolution images of what's behind the stone's surface, uncovering the surprises. One of the most interesting finds are deep vertical wells found at great depths under the Great Pyramid. These four to five meter diameter cylindrical shafts reach as deep as nearly 600 meters. The purpose of these wells is not yet clear, but their massive size and construction indicate that they were designed and crafted as part of the larger architectural plan of the pyramid. In contrast to natural fissures, which tend to be irregular in shape, these wells are perfectly smooth and have uniform cross sections. Their geometric accuracy and alignment with the pyramid corners prompt the question, were these shafts part of a larger, more elaborate system? The clearly defined shapes and depths of these shafts imply they were not a decorative element or a natural occurrence, but a deliberate feature. The question many researchers are now considering is whether or not these wells might have been constructed to direct some kind of energy perhaps having tapped into a source that is not known to us today. These shafts' alignment with the corners of the pyramid, even down to the precise calculations, implies a sophisticated knowledge of geometry, which might indicate an ancient technology that might have been intended for manipulation of energy or other utilitarian applications. This revelation has sparked new speculation about the possible uses of the pyramids. The accuracy of these subsurface features, along with their mysterious function, contradict the conventional story that the pyramids were purely tombs. What if these buildings were used for something much more nuanced, functional, or even technological? These subterranean shafts might be part of a complex system, one that could have tapped natural forces in ways that today's technology is just starting to grasp. As studies go on, the secrets of the pyramids remain to be revealed, and they provide fascinating glimpses into the sophisticated knowledge of ancient societies, the function of the wells and the spiral pathways. The recent finding of deep vertical wells under the Great Pyramid has generated new interest in the actual purpose of the structure. These wells, which are in parallel rows, are unlike anything that has been discovered in other ancient Egyptian pyramids. Their geometric accuracy and the complexity of their design indicate that they were not just structural features but could have had much more sophisticated functions, perhaps even involving the harnessing or channeling of energy. One of the most fascinating features found within some of these wells is the existence of a spiral ramp or avenue that spirals upward or downward along the inner walls. This quiet but powerful find suggests a two-fold purpose for these shafts. The spiral ramps might have had functional uses, like the movement of material or provisions between levels, helping in the process of construction or reaching various levels of the pyramid's subterranean chambers. But these corridors might have also been utilized for symbolic or ceremonial purposes, bringing the living together with the gods and the hereafter. The underworld was an important domain in ancient Egyptian culture, most commonly represented by the passage of the soul following death. The spiral ramps might have served in a ritualistic process so that priests or officials could proceed to the pyramid's interior as part of divine rituals. It is the very precise alignment with the geometry of the pyramid that makes the wells all the more interesting. The shafts are not positioned haphazardly, but instead strategically located at most salient points of the pyramid's corners, 
fueling speculation that they were integral to the general structural support of the monument. The wells could have been load-bearing pillars, assisting with transferring the enormous weight of the pyramid evenly to a greater area. In the process, they would have prevented the pyramid from moving or falling over the millennia, showing sophisticated engineering and distribution of weight knowledge by the pyramidal builders. But their layout, let alone their geometry, implies that their use may have had a purpose other than structural reinforcement. Scientists have started to theorize that these shafts may have been part of a system used to direct energy, possibly from natural sources like geothermal or electromagnetic energy within the Earth. The spiral ramps, especially, appear to suggest some mechanism for gathering, storing, or dispensing this energy, which might have had ceremonial, spiritual, or even utilitarian uses. The concept that the pyramids were not only built as tombs, but also as energy-harnessing devices, unlocks intriguing possibilities. Ancient Egyptian society was highly attuned to cosmic energies, and much of their religious and architectural practices were aimed at aligning their monuments with the stars, the Earth's energy, and the flow of life. The orientation of the wells with the corners of the pyramid may symbolically reflect a link to the natural power of the Earth, bringing the physical edifice into correspondence with the metaphysical preoccupations of the ancient Egyptians. As the search goes on, and new technologies are used to investigate these subsurface features, it's increasingly evident that the function of the wells and the pyramid itself was much more advanced than that of merely being a two. They could have been created as energetic conduits, which would allow the ancient Egyptians to harness invisible forces. These findings turn around our conception of ancient technology and make us question the real motive behind one of the most recognizable buildings in the world. The pyramid's mystery is by no means unraveled, and with each new find, another dimension to the puzzle of these ancient relics is added, linking the wells to ancient energy theories. The theory that the pyramids were constructed as sophisticated energy systems is a compelling one, picking up speed over the years. Alternative theories for decades have suggested that the Egyptians had a profound knowledge of energy technologies. Some believe the pyramids were constructed to tap into natural forces, for example, the Earth's electromagnetic fields or even cosmic energy. The deep wells under the Great Pyramid, combined with their spiral tunneling, create the potential that these buildings were not only tombs, but energy harvesters or tubes. This concept is also similar to ancient Egyptian religious literature which speaks about the pyramids as houses of life and possibly denotes a link between the physical world and the divine. The very specific placement and alignment with stars and other heavenly bodies by the pyramid also leads one to think that it was possibly meant to attract and guide energy from both the heavens and the earth. Furthermore, the huge blocks of stone located at the foundation of these wells might not have a structural role alone. Theorists claim that these blocks were deliberately arranged to dampen seismic vibrations, thus making the pyramid more resistant to natural forces. This indicates that the ancient Egyptians could have designed the pyramid to act as an energy-stabilizing mechanism, shielding it from environmental stress. These findings are going to redefine our knowledge of ancient Egypt, showing that the pyramids may have been used for a much more complex purpose than was previously assumed. The Hidden Subterranean Network New radar sweeps of the Giza Plateau have uncovered a staggering find, a sophisticated underground system that runs beneath the entire plateau, much farther than the Great Pyramid. The system, made up of tunnels, chambers, and wells, indicates a plan far more complex than initially supposed. While for centuries the attention was directed toward the surface pyramids themselves, today researchers are finding concealed aspects that connect the buildings beneath the surface. The concept of underground tunnels and chambers 
is not novel in ancient Egyptian society, as most tombs have secret compartments which indicate the strong belief in the afterlife. The extent of this network under the Giza Plateau, however, is unprecedented. The recently unearthed wells and tunnels seem to create a link between the three large pyramids, Khufu's Great Pyramid, Khafra's Pyramid, and Menkara's Pyramid. This revelation implies that the whole plateau was designed as one great overall system, maybe with the pyramids working collectively in a fashion that science still has not begun to fully appreciate. The sophistication of this underground system is intriguing speculation regarding the ancient Egyptians' knowledge of energy. The tunnels could have been used to channel or distribute energy throughout the plateau, connecting the pyramids in a coordinated fashion. It's an intriguing concept. What if the pyramids were not monumental tombs, but components of a massive underground energy grid meant to tap and redirect natural forces? The concept of interconnected underground features could even refer to an overarching vision for the pyramid complex as a whole, one that struck a balance between religious and functional considerations to form a balanced system operating on more than one level. This subterranean system not only adds to the enigma of the pyramid's original function, but also suggests a degree of architectural and technological advancement that may be way beyond what we know today. With each new discovery, they're rewriting our perception of ancient Egypt, and we're seeing a much more sophisticated and integrated civilization than we ever thought. Although much is yet to be revealed, one fact is certain. The Great Pyramids of Giza were more than mere architectural wonders. They were perhaps designed with a phenomenal knowledge of both energy and structure. The new finds offer intriguing prospects regarding the innovative technologies the ancient Egyptians might have employed, raising questions about their relationship with energy sources decades ahead of their time. As we keep digging deeper into these ancient marvels, we want you to join the discussion. What do you believe these new findings might imply for our knowledge of history? Leave your thoughts in the comments section below. And don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more thrilling updates on this amazing adventure. Thanks for watching and stay curious.